Classmates had to wipe away tears. Teammates hugged one another at a vigil to honor Jasper Howard. The University of Connecticut cornerback stabbed to death on campus. It was early Sunday morning when Howard was killed outside the student union. Wednesday night, the Yukon community gathered to remember the Miami native. Six, you know we love you, and we know you miss you. You know we miss you. We gonna hold it down for you regardless. We love the way you sing, we love the way you dance, and we love the way you always like to keep a smile on our face. And we gonna hold it down for you, Six. We love you, little bro. Members of the Yukon team have credited head coach Randy Edsel for helping them through this crisis. It's a privilege, not a right. It's a privilege for me to be the head coach and to be able to coach young men like these guys here. UConn will travel to West Virginia Saturday for its first game since Howard's death. The team will wear stickers on their helmets to remember him. The team will also bring his jersey and helmet to all road games. We don't want y'all walking around campus looking at the players and being sad. Just, just be happy that Jazz taught us what he taught us because Jazz was a very special person. And he wouldn't want to see any of you all like this crying. Jazz like to see people smiling. A 21-year-old Hartford man was arrested at the scene of the stabbing but has not been charged in connection with Howard's death. A funeral is planned for Monday. Edsel says the entire UConn football team will travel to Miami for it. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.